My name's John Alexander. I came to BFA as a senior just this year. Yeah, I came out of Honduras. My family's been living there uh, as medical missionaries for the last six years. I decided it was, uh, it was time for me to leave that place. Uh, I had plenty of fond memories. Uh, my brothers and I grew up in the jungle. We were able to play soccer and work at the hospital. But I knew um, that a time was coming when I would have to re-enter society. And I also kind of wanted a, a taste of the average like high school experience. So um, way back, I think, we used to live in Germany. Uh, we toured BFA once. And I, I was like 12 years old, and I hardly remember it. But uh, I mean, 12, I was maybe 12 years old. And I think I was 17 at the time when my dad brought it up, the idea of going to BFA with my brother. And it seemed like a really unique opportunity, uh, being able to go to a boarding school and live in the Black Forest. And uh, so I came here with my brother, and it's, it's been great. I've been able to kind of get my feet wet in terms of re-entering society and prepare myself for uh, what lays ahead in the future. Um, so that's why I came to BFA. I really enjoyed it so far. Obviously, uh, COVID's been a very big part in my experience at BFA. Uh, many things were canceled, sports, trips trips to Rome and stuff. And it's easy to get the mindset of, it's because of COVID I didn't have a full experience. Or, but there's been so many, I think, blessings because of COVID in a way. Um, I came to BFA trying to get away from being homeschooled and the first thing that happened was I was locked in a building with 20 other people from all around the world I've never met to be homeschooled for basically two weeks. Um, but because of that, I was able to grow a very personal relationship with my dorm and I was uh, really able to strengthen my character uh, by hearing what other people had to say, where they came from and hear their opinions about certain you know, facts or issues and I was able to kind of for my own because of it. And on top of that, I mean, even though COVID is taking, I think, taking a lot away from this class of 21, I mean, just last week I was hiking the Alps in Switzerland and then paintballing in France. I mean, how many, how many high school seniors do that? Not, I mean, not many. So while it's been challenging, I would do it all over again in a heartbeat. Um, it's been an absolute blast. I've been able to grow my relationship with, with Christ and with just my character. So it, it was difficult at first. Uh, I missed home a lot, you know, getting used to new school uh, and reapplying to different schools. The whiplash of that was, was difficult, but I, I'd do it all over again if I could. Next step I'm not really 100% sure on yet. Uh, thankfully I was accepted to Texas A&M, but I'm praying and considering uh, joining the Marine Corps first to help pay for college a little bit, do the reserves. Those are both very different experiences, but I feel like BFA has prepared me for both of them. I feel like I've been equipped with how to handle more, you know, different backgrounds, different people, and how to address different struggles and how to make decisions decisively. So um, whether it be A&M or the military, uh, BFA has, I think, just allowed me to, as I said earlier, get my feet wet with, you know, society and the rest of the world before I re-enter. So, if BFA has kind of shown me anything, it's I think, the goodness of God. Um, I've gone through many transitions throughout life, but without fail, I've always been provided for uh, with a solid community, good friends, and lifelong experiences and memories. So. Whenever I get anxious and nervous about the future, I often look back to all the times that I've had to move across the world, and yet God has provided for me, and I know He'll continue to do so.